Hey guys, welcome back to my craft room. Today, <clears throat> we're going to make a pocket letter. I feel like that's all we've done for the past, like, well, since Christmas. <laughs> I feel like that's, we've just been on a pocket letter roll. <laughs> But today's pocket letter, I wanted to theme around summer, like a summer party. I made a um, sunshine themed Happy Meal. And then I was just like, okay, I want to, there's something funky on there. I want to make something that's very sunshiny and bright and fun <laughs> so I figured I'd use some of the leftovers from the sunshine happy mail the embellishments that I made which you probably will see that video later um, I want to post it after the person has received it so it'll probably be a little bit longer <laughs> than you will see it um, I kind of want to do more of a yellow, orange, green, maybe. Just some really bright, fun colors that are more summery, I guess. Okay, so that's the... Let's use this yellow here. Ooh, this green. And this yellow polka dot. liking that one it's a little bit too dark I also want some papers to uh, we can use the back side of that one to create some tags maybe another blue I feel like that pink's a little bit too meh not quite what I'm looking for, I think. I mean, that yellow would be good too, but I feel like that's, I already have a lot of yellow going on. I need one more color, kind of. Look at that pink. Yeah. Okay, that should be enough, I am thinking. So some of these I'm going to be doing the inserts. So three and a half by two and a half. Three and a half. Two and a half. And we're doing a full size, so I need eight inserts or nine. <laughs> I do eight if I'm doing a shaker pocket. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight. And nine. I actually think I'm going to move one of the yellows out of the way and do an extra green. Cuz 
so we do have an extra few sets of yellows. <laughs> and then I want to go ahead and trim these down. I'm thinking to make some little tags. One and a half. Maybe two inches. Maybe that's yeah, I don't think that'll be too small. I'll just go ahead and cut that off right now. Just in case I want to use it later. Two inches. I could go through that whole stack. Oof. Two inches. Been in such a like bright colored mood. I even started working on a little garden which I've kind of been I've wanted a garden for a little while because we live in such a small apartment and there's like no yard <laughs> I've just been like no I'm not even gonna bother with it but then I uh I'm doing two by three I think that'll be a good size but I decided this year I wanted to just go ahead and do one. So I got some of those, the plastic like fence picks. <laughs> I got those from Dollar Tree and I spray painted them with a purple spray paint. And oh my gosh, it is so pretty. It didn't turn out like the name of the spray paint is Plum Purple. And I was like, oh no, this might turn out really bad. <laughs> but it ended up being so pretty. It ended up looking more like a rose gold. More like a, a little bit more purple than a rose gold. But like that kind of tint. Oh, it's gorgeous. So then I decided to spray... I have uh, like little birdhouse sticks, stakes, whatever you want to call them, that have a little lantern spot for them. And I decided to spray that with the spray paint since it was starting to rust. I've had those since we moved in, which was, oh gosh, almost four years, I'm thinking. And then I also got some of those other hooks from Dollar Tree and I spray painted those in that purple. It looks so good. Oh. And I bought a few seed packets, so we'll see how, <laughs> how it goes this year. <laughs> the yard is like a mess. I, but I really hope that it's, you know, healthy enough to grow something. Come on. I'm starting out with flowers because I don't think vegetables are really going to be able to cut it. <laughs> Especially with so many animals around here. They would just tear them to pieces. And the lawn people, they don't care about anything. <laughs> they just want to be as fast as they can be so that's why I ended up doing the little fencing because I knew if I didn't they would totally mow over whatever I planted I guess I should have checked yeah that's a pretty good size it's a little bit big but it'll be fine I 
I'm just so excited. <laughs> I'm really looking forward to having a nice looking lawn. But now we have a dog that is right next to us. And I've already found some poo in our yard. So I don't know. <laughs> I think even if I try, <laughs> people aren't going to let it happen. <laughs> Which is weird because you would think that having a dog, you would want them to have a nice little yard. Or not little, you would want them to have a nice yard. But no. It's just a little patch of land. And uh, I just. <laughs> People, dog owners who don't actually take care of their dogs, irks me so bad. also been interfering with our sleeping because we sleep during the day and the dog is yapping the whole time because people walk by and it's not trained so just yep yep I mean I guess it's better than having a smoker that was horrible Okay. And then I think I'm going to create some banners out of these guys. Oh, this is our <laughs> Let's see about that size. Try and get it with one swoop. Mm. Just cut that in half. Some of them are going to be a little bit longer. But that'll just make it a little bit more interesting, right? <laughs> I don't know if I want to use my stapler or not. I kind of think I do. I just love the look of the stapler. And I forgot to mention that this is actually going to Oh, why did I just blink on her her YouTube name? Crafting with Ivy, right? Gosh. <laughs> I'm so bad at names. <laughs> I'll make sure to put the name down below. Well, it's for Ivy. She's having her 600 subby giveaway and she just wanted pocket letter index card or memory card memory dex card I was like of course I'll make you a pocket letter and I was like what theme do you want she's like anything I was like oh no <laughs> so I was like what am I gonna do I kept going through like different themes in my head. I was like, no, no, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. Finally, I was like, you know what? We're going to do this. <laughs> I'm on a kick. <laughs> I did. I was almost going to make a Halloween one. It, I was so close to making a Halloween one. It's always that challenge, though, of is that person going to like it if I make, like, a Halloween pocket letter in March and give it to them in March? <laughs> I'm always not sure about that. 
It's like, I would love to receive a Halloween one in March, but I know some people probably wouldn't. <laughs> Let's do a blue and a green. I want to layer them up here. A little bit of blue back there. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> Cute. Do a pink and a blue on this one. Do a yellow and green. Some of them I'm going to just do. Oh, actually, I'm just going to do the yellow on that one. That looks really good. Just like that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I've got one more over here. I shouldn't have doubled them up. Oh, looks so good though. Could always cut more if I really wanted to. Yeah, I think I might cut more. Because I really like that look. Oh, that's not the right size. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> it's like, wait, that's not right. I'm just going to cut more. So I just really like that look. Oops. Got to remember what measurements I did. We did the green stripe. And how many do I need? One, two, three, four, five. And that's going to do one, two, three, four. And I can just cut that yellow one down. Awesome. Sounds good to me. Three and a no, no. Three inches. Cut off that. Three inches by two inches. Right? <laughs> and be like, nope, that's not right. I get actually oh I think it's because I didn't cut the inserts so I get that extra one okay oh I hate when that happens <laughs> my punches do that all the time I wonder why they just kind of get stuck I don't know if that's a normal thing I think it's just my punches. <laughs> Granted, this is a very old punch. Probably needs sharpened. And sometimes I do use it on washi <laughs> and not dried glue. 
So it's probably got some film on it. <laughs> it's been abused. <laughs> Okay. Should have done it <laughs> cut more green before adding. Okay. We've got too much green. It's going to be green on top of green. I'll have to switch it around. Do some of the flowers. I mean, green on green probably doesn't look that bad, but. <laughs> just looks a little bit more springy with those flowers on there instead of summery. Oh, I need more. Can I trim this down? Just gonna cut it. Cut the little notches. all of them have two except for that one yeah I could do because that's I could do like the center one yeah I think that's what I'll do just because I don't want to cut one more <laughs> that just seems like a pain <laughs> that I don't really want to do I'm going to take some washi And just put it down at the bottom here. Some blue floral. this washi it's just so cute I've been using it on like everything lately so easy to use too okay so now let's get the stapler out oh 
Oh, I'm gonna grab. Grab a pink. Actually, let's do it over here. Pink and let's kind of separate these. See which colors need to be added on. Looks like I need the yellow for words. Okay. And just one staple will be good. Need a green and a yellow word. Need a yellow word and a pink. Ouch. Okay. Need a green and a yellow word. Oh, I wonder if that's how I got that. Oh, I bet that I bet that's what happened. <laughs> I've been wondering what the heck happened to my hand lately. Well, this just my thumbnail. Oh, you can't even see. There you go. It's just got that dark mark right there and I was like, oh maybe it's just um sharpie or whatever, but it hasn't been coming off. And I just realized it was probably my stapler because it hit right there and it kinda hurt. Hopefully it doesn't do much damage. I, mean, I can't imagine really realistically being that bad, but you never know. I have been puzzling my brain over what the heck happened. <laughs> That one's going to have to have green on it. Okay. So now I've got a few different options of what to put on there. I've got stickers. I've got some fussy cut images that I colored up. Stamped images. Trying to get all these little pieces out of here. So here are the stickers and my images, and then a few sentiments. Want to add some lemonades? Need to be cute on that one. Then we can do two glasses of lemonade like that. Look at the, let's do some fireworks. Let's 
some sunglasses. Where needs to go? The pink one. These flip flops. Let's do the ice creams. Guess they're more popsicles, not ice cream. And then I've got this guy right here, the last one. Kind of wondering if I want to kind of thinking about putting a little pitcher and then also a cup. That's cute. So then I've got some sentiments. A you're invited. Party. Let's put that one on the. <laughs> um, I'm actually going to use Let's grab an ink. I didn't want to do all the sentiments like that color would be best here. Let's do blue. That should stand out pretty well. Let's do enjoy the moment. Do this on that yellow. Let's do vacation vibes only. Oh, Um, let's do the day off. Come on. <laughs> Doesn't want to let go. Let it go. Oh, there we go. <laughs> day off. Some of them I'm probably not going to be able to do a sentiment. I want to do one of them that has the hello. Maybe I'll do oh the same sentiments on those. Last two. Oops. <laughs> I just tried to um, put my. <laughs> I just tried to ink my stamp with this side of the cloth the case. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> I got one more that I can do. An actual well, one of these on. I kind of 
kind of feel like I just want to do the fun. Like, that. it's just, <laughs> it's so little, but it works. Fun. <laughs> Uh, I'm not careful. I'm going to lose that one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and then we'll just do the party. And another you're invited. Up here. Perfect. Okay, anything else I want to add to them? Nope, I think they're good. Let's grab our sheet. Oof. That's our center. Gosh, this is so cute. I love all the layering. It just looks so good. And then put a little bit of white rickrack right down the side. Thought about doing yellow, but I thought the white would just be a nice little touch. Cute. And hmm. Thinking, do I want to add a sticker or something to the sides? Kind of don't think so. I kind of just like it like that. Like I feel like adding anything else is going to be like, poof. <laughs> yeah, I really like that. Okay, let's go ahead and add goodies. And the back looks good too. <laughs> let's go with some rickrack. with those extra papers. We'll throw in those too. Hopefully they don't get lost. Cute. Oh my gosh. Just going to cut out the rest of these stickers. She can use those up. See what else I want to add. Do, do, do. Just 
just looking through my bin real fast. Let's have this doily. It's nice and pink. Hopefully it doesn't get caught on that staple. Oh, perfect. Wonderful. Hmm. It's always interesting trying to find what I want to put in there. Because I always like go through this debate of oh, that would look cute. Or do I really want to put that in there because it doesn't quite match the theme? I think those look pretty good. I think they match pretty well. Oh, here's some more blue circles. I'll do a whole thing of blue scallop circles. Well, let's add that in there. I know it's not specifically a USA July 4th theme, but I think it's still fun. Still kind of matches, you know, summer party. Right? <laughs> I'll put that washi in there. I'll put that little sample of um, gemstones or bling. Because it's got all the colors. Come on, open up. Perfect amount. Oops. Someone snuck in there. <laughs> Actually, I think I will right on this one. Write a little info card on there. Oh, and then I'll put the... Ah, how cute! Eep! <laughs> oh, how cute! Stick that in there. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. <laughs> oh... I love how this one turned out. Those colors are just so pretty. And I love all the layering. So much interest, you know. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. 
there is my summer party pocket letter <laughs> for Ivy's 600 subby giveaway. Ugh, so exciting. So cute. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me while I made it. I hope you are having a crazy day. Good crazy, not bad crazy. And I'll see you in the next one.